Welcome, here's another haul. We've been dumpster diving again. We go twice a week usually. And we got another uh, more flowers. This is four bouquets of flowers. And over here we have a little plant. It's called the Christmas star here in the Netherlands. You also have it in red and in white. I don't know if it's internationally known, but it's nice. Um, two times bread. Once, yeah, it's, I think it's maybe Dutch, but it's a, a pastry with apple inside, apple flop. And over here we have almond, yeah, um, almond pastry. Donuts with uh, covered in chocolate. And usually there's a lot more of these uh, pastries, but we don't take it all because otherwise it won't be healthy and we will get very fat. So, uh, yeah. But sometimes we choose a few things just also to give away and to have something nice to eat. Uh, two times mayonnaise with yogurt. And then we have three packages of uh, pizza dough with uh, uh, tomato sauce. We really like these. We get them once in a while. Sometimes like a big uh, staple of them. I'm not sure if that's correct English. But sometimes a lot of them. And the kids also love it. So then we can make our own pizza. It's nice. And over here there is uh, yeah, bami. It's some kind of meal. Vegan um, kind of bacon. And over here nine packages of falafel. Which is really cool and nice. Five times vegan meatballs. And over here, two times, it's like chicken, uh, yeah, roast, roll up, rollade, it's called in Dutch. It's like, and then you can cut it. So you put it in the oven, I think, or in the pan. I'm not really specialized in meat, but uh, yeah. So we're going to give that away. And these are chicken legs marinated. And here are chicken, um, yeah, thigh filet, it says. And over here, Jäger schnitzel and um, deer uh, steak, steak made of deer. And over here, I wanted to show you this. This is how we found it in the dumpster. Let me see if I can get it. So these are all, and I'm going to show you in more detail later. These are all barbecue uh, products, but it's just like a, yeah, it's a bag, garbage bag, kind of full of yeah, just stuff. It's totally useful, but they just throw it out because the season is over. And over here, this is also very fun, very surprise. We found, I haven't counted them yet, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve Advent calendars. And it's, uh, it's filled with um, uh, fruit snacks. So that's really cool because, yeah, well... Usually cheap chocolate uh, advent calendars. I don't think they are really nice. We have one time uh, Anna and Elsa frozen. Yes. And then a few Paw Patrols and a few unicorns. So the children were very happy with that. And of course we're going to divide them between children in the neighborhood and uh, friends. And over here we have our fruit and vegetable section. As always, very uh, good... Uh, uh, yeah, very well supplied. We have three times smoothies from Innocent. It's tropical fruit smoothie. We have one pear, one grapes, chopped up vegetables with cabbage and pepper and all kind of vegetables. Two times this one. These are different. This is more like uh, raw. That you eat raw like a salad. It's with uh, raisins in there. And over here it's uh, white cabbage with tauge some kind of sprouts and over here very nice we have organic um, cauliflower and uh, non-organic cauliflower we have one bag that has been opened in the store and that's why it's thrown out with potatoes but the potatoes are like totally fine so that's really great and we have a lot of salads yay i love the salads one with smoked salmon one with goat cheese always very nice and three with grilled vegetables. So as vegans, that one is nice. And then we have one lunch salad with nuts. And one salad with pesto and tomato. And some seeds and nice pesto dressing and uh, uh, cheese, like Parmesan cheese. And over here, more salads. Twice a salad with red beet. And so here you can see it with beets. And it's also really nice 
with a little bit of goat cheese as well smoked chicken salad and here with mozzarella and pasta and tomatoes and a lot of yummy stuff yes usually this time of year the salads are really nice still because also uh, during the day it's like a few degrees only like degrees celsius over here we have three bags yeah i think this one is new i haven't seen it around the holidays you get different kind of food so that's that's nice you also saw it with the meat that there was yeah, some kind of festive meat um but this is with um they call it provencal so like french style with uh, yeah i don't know all the translations bisloke it's some kind of herb kind of uh, garlicky red onion leek red bell pepper and broccoli three bags of that over here we have one bag of uh, uh, carrots three bags of little tomatoes oh no this is uh, little bell peppers that you can snack on and then three bags four bags actually of uh, tomatoes like uh, only reds or then mixed broccoli and another package of tomatoes over here we have uh, let's count one two three four five and we've had these before like a lot of times so it's with corn and with kidney beans and then different kinds of vegetables over here we have something that you can make like a uh, mash with match mashed potatoes it's with yeah it's with kale and uh, carrot and onion over here there is uh, lettuce here we have two packages uh, that you can make uh, burritos with so there are seasoning in there and tomatoes carrots you can see it better with this one red onion bell peppers a lot of yummy stuff and of course the burri little burritos in there as well this is a package that you can make soup with and this is also very dutch it's a uh, soup with peas green peas soup you get a very thick soup but it's nice we can make it and uh, lettuce and then two times another <laughs> i'm sorry for the children but they are here they uh, they have the right of their space as well and um, so we have two cabbage uh, two lettuce and then two packages that you can make um, mash with mashed potatoes stumpled and then chopped up uh, peas so now I'm going to unpack the barbecue stuffs and I will lay it out for you and then you will see it. All right, so <clears throat> I've had it all laid out. There is some kind of cleaning device. And uh, over here we have two grill plates and yeah, some kind of, that you can make, um, yeah, how do you say it? That you can put something on. And then put it on the barbecue and over there as well here we have shot glasses plastic ones for uh, like tequila or something and then a few packages of uh, barbecue smoke box with herbs and with some wood chipped wood uh, chips wood uh, like i think 10 packages of that nine ten packages of that for gas lighters yes and three packages of wood chips a lot of packages of red cedar smoke shelf that's those are just wooden shelves nice and over here disposable um, yeah plates and disposable cups a few of those like 10 packages or something and then three packages of plastic and two of red disposable cups and this is really nice oven mittens because we needed those so that's nice and over here yeah some kind of devices that you can clean the barbecue with this one i don't know all the english names but it's nice and this just gets thrown out apparently at the end of barbecue season so it's such a waste they could have given it to their um, staff or yeah give it away or just save it for next year but no no gets thrown out so what's such a waste so we are get, glad we could save it